Inspections are run in Verisurf using Auto-Inspect. This interface can be used with a manual or automatic device to measure a part. It can also be used in offline mode to analyze existing data. When I open Auto-Inspect, we see the list of features, the surface grid, and the calculations that make up the plan. I'll configure Auto-Inspect to display a report as soon as the inspection is complete. Next, I'll choose Run and verify that the CMM is ready. As the plan executes, the maximum deviation of the selected properties for each feature is displayed. If all the selected properties for a feature are in tolerance, it's highlighted in green, otherwise it's shown in red. Notice that while the inspection is running, I can switch to another instance of Verisurf to continue programming another inspection. This makes the system very efficient. When the inspection is complete, Verisurf opens the report to display the results. In it, we see the feature properties that we chose to report. To demonstrate offline inspection, I'll clear the results and then export the analysis to a point cloud. When I choose Run Offline, Verisurf recalculates the results and displays the data from the initial inspection. Next, I'll place another part in the fixture and rerun the inspection. Rather than align the part using the joystick, I'll add auto-align to the inspection plan so we can run it automatically. I'll highlight the targets and add them to the plan. In the Automate Manager, I'll move auto-align to the top of the list. Notice how we see the change reflected instantly in the auto-inspect dialog. I'll then clear and run the plan, which now begins with the alignment. When the plan is complete, Verisurf displays the inspection report. We've now seen how to program an inspection and check multiple parts using automation. Next, we'll see how to measure in manual mode and how to use teach mode to program an inspection.